things I gotta talk about. What, why are we still talking about EJ Manuel? And who says Fred Jackson even wants to come here? Heck, hell no. Stop it. Everyone, stop it. Knock it off, cut it out. You need to cut it. Stop. Fred Jackson is 35 years of age. And then you've got the non-football injury illness list. Now, I don't know what that means, a non-football injury illness. I mean, Marcel Darius was just on ESPN a couple days ago, and he looked perfectly fine. With his sailor's hat on, mind you. Eric Stryker, to me, looked like a stud yesterday. Really unblockable. They, could, they had their chance to expose Darby last year, and they didn't. When I was at training camp a couple days ago, EJ Manuel realistically looked like the best quarterback in the roster. The death backer position is what they call it, which is a hybrid outside linebacker, strong safety, essentially in the box. Tyrod's best quality and the most important thing he can do this year is be available to the Bills offense, to Greg Roman, to Rex Ryan, and that's by staying healthy. And if you can't stay healthy, you can't help this team. Three impact players who are going to step in and they're going to play right away, and I think that's exciting for a lot of Bills fans. Bills fanatics, I, I think this is going to be great content for um, for your the listeners and the uh, the followers of Bills fanatics. I, I only see this stuff getting better and better as we move along here. Now, if anybody else has any questions. I'm going to stand here and sip my beer for a moment. At the end of the day, we are all Bills fans, and all we want is to get into the damn playoffs. I don't care who they bring in to make this shit happen. Let's make it happen. Ladies and gentlemen, go Bills.